Hello, all. Katie Robertson here, and I am going to show you how to model on AAC while you are giving a reading mastery lesson. Now, I would look at the lesson ahead of time and look at the words that my student has access to, and I would pick two or three words that I'm going to focus on and make sure that I know where they are. This is talking about everyone stand up and everyone sit down. And I know this board pretty well. And I know that up is right here and down is right here. So I am going to focus on the words up and down. And those are the only words that I'm going to model on the AAC. And when I model them, I am not going to expect the student to do anything in response. I'm just going to be talking to them and their language, showing them what's possible, and making it routine to use this kind of communication, sort of familiarizing them with it and getting them accustomed to it. So I would just deliver the lesson as normal, get ready to do some actions, watch my hand, remember to wait for the signal. Everybody stand up. Everybody sit down, down. Let's do those actions again. Everybody stand up. And you might need to use your own voice and say up if the thing you're modeling on doesn't have any voice output. My turn, what are you doing? Standing up. Your turn, what are you doing? And if they say standing up, you can say standing up. Everybody sit down, down. Let's do those actions some more. So you don't have to stress out about modeling every single word on the t talker or on the board that's in the lesson or that's in the book or that you say. Just pick some important words that repeat over and over again and focus on modeling those.